A common sight all over the city. Doesn't matter if parking spaces are available, but it's illegal. Baker 10, I have a car stop 200 block. Of Back on April 13th, a city police sergeant attempted to enforce the law. How you doing, sir? Sergeant McGowan, Baltimore City Police. This interaction is being recorded. I need your license and registration. The driver is Marvin McKinstry, the chair of a task force appointed to improve civilian oversight of city police under the DOJ consent decree. He had just dropped off a passenger. Are you refusing to give me your license and registration, sir? It's a lawful order. The officer has every right to approach the vehicle and do it exactly as the officer did here. It would raise suspicions if somebody decides to not comply. License and registration, sir. Can I just get an estimate on how many times I have to say this to you, sir? You don't have to say License and registration, sir. Told you that I'm not going to cooperate with you having a problem with me dropping off a pass. License. Uh, this gentleman was being defiant from the beginning. Um, the officer would have simply probably cited him or even given him a warning. Because he stopped me for letting my well, colleague out the License and registration. Or what? I or tried you to will be subject to arrest. But I don't need I you to let you to me. Go in and do that. I don't need you to let so me, why sir. Haven't you done it? Because I think that you're letting your emotion get the better no of you, emotion. sir. McKinstry finally handed over his license. He got five tickets totaling five hundred dollars. He refused to sign them. There's your license. You're free to go. Do not stop in the middle of traffic, whether you have your flashers on or not. It's against the law. Have a nice day. Thanks for your cooperation. According to the mayor's office, the police told them that the tickets have not been satisfied. McKinstry has not responded to repeated requests for an interview. Reporting live in East Baltimore, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News.